A wet area of Grand Prairie just inside Tarrant County is facing somewhat of an entertainment crisis. Bars without go-go dancers. Tuesday, the city council passed an ordinance outlawing strip tees, burlesque, or go-go dancing, punishable with a fine up to $200. The controversy began in December when an exhibition dancing permit was issued to the N Club on a 90-day trial basis. In the meantime, the Alcoholic Beverage and Study Committee had filed a report recommending that this type of dancing be banned in the local clubs. On uh, this past Tuesday, the time the ordinance was passed, the uh, original club, uh, permit for the N Club was expiring. They were present, along with two new requests for permits. Uh, representatives from each of these three clubs recommended and went along in favor of this ban. Some clubs, however, said the ban came as a surprise. Barry Kilgore said he plans to have his dancers switch from bikinis to hot pants and halters until he gets a clarification of the new law. We feel that the ordinance is very vague at this particular time. Uh, it has eliminated uh, striptease type dancing, burlesque dancing, and go-go type dancing. Uh, up until this point, we've not been given any definition as to what they term go-go type dancing. We feel that the dancing we're doing here is of a modern nature and that the girls are in no way in violation of any codes that might be considered pornographic. We also feel that the uh, ordinance is basically unconstitutional. Kilgore said the ban will hurt business and many of the 30 or more girls who work along the county line say it will force them to look for work in Dallas or Fort Worth. I don't see any sense in it, you know, because there's nothing wrong with go-going if you do it in taste. And I think it's done on the county line in taste because we have no other choice to do it in taste. Because, like I said, you know, the county line is run by Grand Prairie and we have to do what they say, and I think everybody's tried to get along with them. Although approved Tuesday, the go-go ban doesn't take effect until Saturday, and police say they'll arrest those in violation. Mike Miller, Channel 8 News in Grand Prairie.